Hello everyone, my name is Ashish and in this video I'm going to show you how to calculate uh, the path function and their related functions like path item, path item reverse, path length, path contains, all these functions. So here I have a data set for employee, having employee name and manager name. So path function basically gives you the hierarchy. Let's see how. Let's create a new column and give the name as hierarchy. path in path function we have to give two parameters one is id column name and second one is parent column so in id column name i will pass employee name and in parent column name i will pass manager name so let's pass employee name and then manager name in parent let's close the bracket and we get the hierarchy so in this path function we get hierarchies from top to bottom that is Mike Brown is at top level and John Smith is the given employee and if you see for Sarah Johnson Sarah Johnson's manager is Jane Doe and then Jane Doe's manager is Mike Brown similarly if I see for Emily Shen Emily Shen's manager is Mike Brown so the last one is the given name given employee whereas uh, it starts the hierarchy from that given employee till top of the employee that's how it creates a hierarchy separated by a pipe operator now if I want to see the job level of this uh, of these uh, people John Smith Sarah Johnson Jane Doe and Mike Brown I can calculate the job level as as if I want to see Mike Brown it has only one uh, Mike Brown so the job level for Mike Brown will be one and for Jane Doe it will be job level as two because it's on second place so for that we will have to uh, create a new column and uh, i will give the name as job level and here i will have to use path length function and in path length function i will just have to provide the hierarchy that is the path function i will provide the hierarchy column So it has given me the job level for Jane Doe it's had, it has given me 2 and for Mike Brown it's given me 1. Now if I want to check uh, who is at the job level 2nd uh, from top that is top is Mike Brown. So uh, in my for Mike Brown it will give 1 and Jane Doe it gives 2nd uh, and John Smith is 3rd. Th so if I want to see who is at the uh, level 2 position that that is Jane Doe uh, here and if you want to see here uh, David Lee is at the second level so let's create a new column for that and uh, right who is at level 2 from top for this I will have to use path item function All items uh, I will have to provide path and then position and then is the optional input parameter that is type uh, which I will ignore here so I will provide path and position so for path I will write hierarchy column and uh, I will uh, pick the level 2 so enter so it has provided me the uh, people at level 2 position here for this hierarchy Emily Shen is at second level and here Jane Doe is at second level here David Lee is at second level so it has provided me the level 2 from top similarly uh, uh, if I, if I uh, see the path item reverse function it works the same way but uh, in reverse order that is it, uh, it gives John Smith as 1 Jane Doe as 2 and uh, Mike Brown as 3 so it uh, reverses the order basically so if I want to calculate uh, who is at the bottom to level for that I can use that function so let's uh, create a new column and write who is at level 2 from bottom so I will write path item reverse and here the same thing I will have to provide path and position for path I will write hierarchy 
and position I can give one two or three anything so I will provide two enter and it has given me uh, the level two position from bottom that is it has given me here bike brown as uh, Mac Brown is in the second place from bottom that is Jane Doe is number one and Mike Brown is number two from bottom similarly uh, another function is path contains basically returns you the true or false value so create a new column path contains right path contains and the path is I will give hierarchy C for Jane Doe Jane Doe. So yes, Jane Doe is present in the first three rows and then it is not present in any other rows. If you see Jane Doe is present here, here and here and rest of the hierarchies it is not present. So it has returned the true false values. So that was it for this video. This is how we use path and its related functions. If you like the video, do not forget to subscribe my channel. Thank you.